The head of Germany's Migration and Refugee Agency has been fired amid a scandal where over a thousand migrants entered the country illegally. German prosecutors opened a probe into the Bremen branch of the agency after allegations of corruption and misconduct. An internal review found the agency broke the law, taking payments to approve some 1,200 applications. The violations are thought to have spanned more than three years. The scandal has fueled an ongoing dispute within Germany's governing coalition on how to handle the migrant influx. One of the governing parties, the CSU, is threatening to leave the coalition. And in response, Chancellor Angela Merkel is promising to tighten the rules for refugees. Just changing the head of the office doesn't solve the problem. The problem is of a structural nature. It's just the sheer number of uh, asylum applications which overwhelm those structures. And uh, therefore, it's not the right um, decision now of Horst Seehofer just to exchange uh, Jutta Kort again and uh, put a new person in charge because the basic problem remains the same. Uh, Horst Seehofer um, and his party, they had accepted also uh, the disrespect for the migration laws and the constitution, uh, which was um, yeah, promoted by Angela Merkel in 2015 and which has been carried on until now. So it's quite late now that uh, Horst Seehofer tries to find the responsible or the culpable person at the top of the BAMF uh, organization. He should have broken up the coalition already in 2015 to protest against Angela Merkel breaking uh, German laws and letting uh, migrants uh, flow into our country instead of helping them before already in the Syrian regions or the neighboring regions of Syria.